Welcome back to the channel, Stuart from ZSC Toys and Play, and today we're going to be reviewing the container ship. Okay, so here we have the model completely unboxed, and let's just go through the contents. If you're new to the channel, please consider subscribing, hit the notification bell to be notified when we upload new videos. And if you have any questions about the model, please comment down below and we will um, be happy to help. So as part of the model, you do actually get this scoop. And I'm thinking that if you want to put anything in this little container section here, then you can just scoop it out there. You can as part of which is shown on the box, but is not included in the model, is that you can add which you can see here on the underside, you can add some motors, which I assume can be purchased from Siku. They're not included in the box, but that is something you can do. And that's what these little red clip things are for there. And then you get a sticker pack also as well, there which has the hazards on and fire extinguishers and such. So as we get into the model, you pick up the model. Um, it is fairly heavy, so you do feel like you've got a nice, um, uh, weighted model here in terms of what you've paid for you've got this flag which can be taken off and moved around this is clearly obviously comes off very easy you can um, you can take this in the bath it does flow it doesn't capsize or anything like that so as we go in from the front of the model you have these crane sections here which you can sorry not crane the um, anchors on both sides here which just um, which just unloosen off so there's an additional bit of playability and then obviously you've got this front section here that if you want to it, that, that it, as if you if you want to um, fill it up and then use the scoop section there also along in here you've got this crane section here which you'll be able to see um, does a full through 60 turn also flips over as well which I'm not sure you need to know much that about and then as you've got this section here you can move the crane down to pick up some of the the containers that are here and this works on an elasticated clip which just clips onto there and then you just raise them up and then this moves out here like so okay so the crane obviously moves back and forth as well and then you've got two containers here so you've got two of these containers and then these shut when and as you need them to then you've got this little gantry area here with the spinning round radar there and a um, and a place for the deck of the ship and then on the back side here you've obviously got this ramp which you can see here which you can drive up and then that can come out and connect and extend out to there or it can lock in and then be in place there so and then you can do as you wish with this here bringing this back in and as you can see there's livery on the side there these are these are pretty good quality this is all plastic pretty much everything on this set is plastic but of a decent quality um, so in terms of pros and cons for the model I think one of the cons which you probably saw with me on this is that this crane is not tall enough so when you take something out off of here it does actually just drag all over the place so in terms of playability yes it does have playability but there are a few issues i do have and as you say with the playability section you've got the ramp that comes down here which you can drive cars on and off uh, and then you've got this opening hatch here as well as the crane and the anchors so in terms of playability loads of playability so yeah just one of the negatives was mainly about the crane and getting the container straight out but positives yeah very good model nice size nice for um, little hands i think and it's definitely one that i'd recommend to have in your collection okay if you've got any questions please let me know and i'll be happy to help thanks